Live from KPRC Channel 2, where local news comes first. This is News to Houston with the Nightbeat team. Good evening, our big story. Two women are behind bars tonight, suspects in a real estate scam. Police say the women caught here on our surveillance video posed as potential home buyers to rip off unsuspecting sellers. A scam investigators say was a family affair. News to Houston Nightbeat reporter Chris Gutierrez is live now in Southwest Houston. Chris? Dominique, roughly 20,000 realtors make up the Houston Association of Realtors. And tonight, police credit them with staying alert and helping catch this mother-daughter duo. When you're looking to sell your house... She just said, oh, you've got a beautiful home. Sandra C. will admit the more people who visit, the better. This is the master bedroom where they came in. But now Sandra says beware of bogus buyers. Oh, yeah, that's the daughter. That's her. The woman in this grocery store surveillance video is 32-year-old Catherine McGovern. Authorities say she and her mom, Maureen McGovern, have been posing as home buyers to loot houses all over Houston. And Sandra fell victim last Saturday in Kima. <laughs> it just, man, they're slick. That's what I thought. <laughs> they're slick. Sandra says she stashed her purse in this space under the bathroom sink to get it out of the way while the McGoverns and a realtor looked around. But when no one was watching the McGoverns, they got into Sandra's purse and took credit cards, checks, and a driver's license. And 20 minutes later, they were gone. They left here at 545 and at 613 they made their first purchase. While Sandra's home here in Kima isn't a two-story, authorities say the McGovern often toured two-story homes. You see, either the mother or the daughter would go upstairs with the realtor while the other stayed behind on the first floor looking for things to steal. I thought, well, golly, they didn't even come out and look at the yard. You know, usually when you're buying a house, you come look at the yard and the garage. I felt like I was stupid because rushing around, I forgot to get my purse. And Sandra had no idea that she was a victim here until her credit company actually called her. It appears the McGoverns racked up a nearly $500 credit card transaction at a local Randall's grocery store. We're live in Southwest Houston tonight. I'm Chris McGuinness. Well, both scam suspects will be in court tomorrow. Catherine has been charged with credit card abuse. She is also wanted in Louisiana, but Houston police are not saying why. Maureen McGovern is charged with hindering apprehension after police say she lied when officers came to the house to arrest her daughter.